Cataract surgery is when the cloudy lens within the eye is re removed and replaced by an intraocular lens implant. Preparation for cataract surgery consists of uh, having a thorough eye exam to first of all make a diagnosis of cataract and then uh, measurements are done to decide which intraocular lens implant is going to be used for cataract surgery. And then just prior to cataract surgery, you have to have a medical clearance with your medical doctor along with some blood tests. Uh, three days before cataract surgery, we start prophylactic antibiotics uh, in order to avoid uh, problems like infection. So th that's the preparation before having cataract surgery. Cataract surgery can be done um, as an outpatient. Uh, it can be done in either a hospital setting or an ambulatory surgery set, uh, setting. But it usually requires no more than a few hours rather than being uh, admitted to a hospital. Uh, what a patient experiences on the day of cataract surgery, they uh, arrive and the first thing that happens is they have lots of eye drops put in their eyes uh, to dilate the pupils and get them prepared for surgery. Uh, an IV is then started in the patient's hand so some sedation could be given during the cataract surgery to relax the patient. Uh, what the patient experiences on the day of their surgery is as follows. When they first arrive at the hospital or the ambulatory surgery center, first they're, they're prepped for the surgery. Their eyes clean, they're given dilating drops to dilate the pupil. Uh, at that point, they're brought into the operating room, uh, usually at which time a little bit of sedation is given just to relax the patient, to take the edge off. And at that point, uh, the nurses are getting all the instruments ready, we're focusing the microscope, and then the surgical procedure begins. The surgical procedure usually takes no more than about 20 minutes, usually less, and at that time the cloudy cataract is removed and replaced by an artificial lens implant. Uh, once the surgery is done, the patient's brought back to the holding area where they started. They're usually given a light snack, and as soon as they're feeling well and pretty awake, they actually go home. And they're, before doing that, they're given some instructions as to what to do and what not to do. And basically that first day, it's just taking it easy, keeping the eye dry, and starting all the eye drops that have to be put in. Um, the day following the surgery, the patient goes to visit the doctor and they take a look and make sure there's no infection, the pressure's okay, and just sort of a routine exam just to make sure everything's going well. Uh, usually after that, the patient will see the doctor a week later. And after that, it's usually pretty smooth sailing. The recovery process for cataract surgery is not bad the way we do our surgery today. Uh, because the surgery is done with a small incision, it heals very quickly. So usually an eye patch is not needed, stitches are not needed. Once the patient goes home, the, the most important thing they have to do for, is put eye drops in. For one month, they'll be putting eye drops in two or three times a day. Uh, some of the other precautions, for the first week or two, it's, it's recommended to keep the eye dry when washing up or showering. And it's a little bit, um, it's important also uh, not to do heavy lifting and too much exertion. Other than that, most patients can go about their normal business. They usually can drive the next day uh, and they can resume most activities such as golf and tennis within a week or two. Uh, if you'd like to find out more about cataract surgery or if indeed you do have a cataract, please contact the, our office at North Shore Eye Care and set up a free evaluation at your convenience.